Ingredients 1 pound ground beef, 1 egg, salt and pepper, onion and garlic salt or powder, saltines, canned soup or sauce, do not add water to the canned soup, finely ground breadcrumbs. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Start with your one pound of ground beef. Add one egg. Season with salt, pepper, and your onion and garlic salt or powder. Using herbs and spices is a good idea as long as you know that you will enjoy the flavors together. If you're unsure, I do not suggest this. If you want to be safe, just stick to the main four seasonings. Time to mix everything up. Using your hand will ensure to mix it up well, though you don't have to actually use your hand to mix it. Now, add your saltines by crushing them up. You can also use other types of crackers crushed up as well. Now, move your hamburger mixture to your baking pan. Most people typically use a bread loaf pan, but I don't own one, so I'm using a baking round instead. Make sure your meatloaf is flattened and smoothed to, into the pan for a very nice even cooked. Now, add your tomato soup or sauce on top. Remember, you do not want your tomato soup to be mixed up with water. It would be too thin. Try and coat the entire top of the meatloaf. The soup will help keep the meatloaf from drying out and also keeps the breadcrumbs securely on top. Now it's time to add your breadcrumbs. Make sure to try and get a nice even spread all over the top of your meatloaf. Now into the oven. Cook for 15 to 25 minutes. The meatloaf should be cooked to 365 degrees Fahrenheit. And that is how you make American meatloaf. Thank you to everyone who has been so supportive of my cooking tutorials. I really do hope that I have helped you learn how to cook some new dishes that you enjoy. It's an honor to be your teacher. Lots of love from your pup, Trina Maria Wellington.